good afternoon and a uh, slightly wet but sunny afternoon at Chobham. Um, down here at Fowler's Wells for the Guildford home game, but we have a very special uh, story to, to mention. Uh, we have the Martin Ledger's lunch attended by 80 people, but um, some special guests that, um, that I'm going to ask Vince to, to introduce and, and give us a story and background about. Well, so this was the uh, cap, retrospective cap presentation for two Scottish uh, rugby internationals who have connections to the area and the club. Um, and Gratefully, we uh, received Colin Rigby, who is chairman of the Scottish Rugby Union, uh, to present the caps. And the families represented, um, so Neil Ramsey, represented by Simon Constant, who's his grandson, flown in from Dubai for the day. And Nicola Fleet and Caroline Blackmore, who were Alec Murray's ex Chobham president, uh, who was also one of the recipients today. So if I can hand over to Colin to say a little bit more. Yeah, no, it's a delight to be down here. This is what rugby is about. We were delighted to be able to award retrospective caps to Neil and to Alec. This is a project that's been a long time in the making. Um, we've awarded 75 retrospective caps in the men's game uh, and added three in the, the women's game. And this is uh, another milestone. We've done three, four of these ceremonies, mainly in Scotland, but it's a delight to be down here and to share this special day with the family of Neil and Alec. So uh, just how do you guys feel about today? I mean, how's today gone? What does it mean to you? Just a very, very proud moment. You know, like was mentioned earlier, I've travelled quite a long way to come here today, but I wouldn't miss it for anything. You know, it's, um, I think sport transcends generations. It brings people together. It just shows as well that you can live on, you know, for eternity, right? You know, if you play sport to a certain level and it brings people together. So, yeah, it's just great to be here. What about you, Nicola? Alan, what are your thoughts on today? Well, we found that, actually surprisingly moving. We didn't, didn't realise what a big thing it was until all these British people came together. And, um, you know, we always felt that we were always very, very proud of Daddy and the fact that he did play for Scotland, but we were never able to say that he was a full international because it was obviously a wartime um, honour. And uh, so now we can finally tell people that our, our father was a full Scottish international and we're very proud of that. Thank you, and thank you. No, absolutely. Uh, you mentioned inside that you actually have memories of, you know, coming down here and knowing some of the people, and, and you know, this club was as much as part of you as, as it was for, for, for him as well. Yeah. Uh, no, I, I think that's, uh, as, as Colin quite rightly mentioned, um, you know, it's, it's a special thing. Uh, so thank you so much for coming down and doing it. Uh, but I think it's a real strength of uh, Chobham, real strength of community rugby, and, and you know, regardless of who you play for, the fact that you play rugby just bonds people together. Um, so thank you all for joining us. Uh, a very special uh, day, um, and I think one we'll, we'll remember for a long time. Uh, just lastly, um, any ideas and scores today, Chobham v Guildford? Big home win for me. Nice, I like that. Yeah, you like the confidence, Simon? Colin, any, any official think. opinion? Let's have a good game of rugby. <laughs> <laughs> How diplomatic is that? <laughs> Thank you everyone so much. Enjoy today and uh, come on the job.